Boom, baby, we're back at it. We are here on a spicy Sunday, and it's not only just a spicy Sunday, it is an October 1st spicy Sunday. So put that in your pipe and smoke it. So as you see, we got the OG man himself, Mike Myers. This is his month. This is the time to shine. This is just a good overall month. I love it, I love October. The spookiness, the sounds of the leaves, the whole shebang ever since I was a kid, I just, oh my goodness, just really, really enjoyed October, you know, because how could you not? Summer is, you know, it just passed, and uh, September is lit, um, but October is like, it's here. It's, you know, it's it's got a little, it's a little something to it, right? But anyways, we are back today trying our new hot sauce that I came across yesterday, and I'm going to be completely honest. I went off the aesthetic of the bottle. I mean, look at this gem right here. We got Fidelli Italian Extra Hot Hot Sauce coming to you straight from Italy, you know, which is kind of took me back as I was pushing the cart. I kind of stumbled a little back because... I've never really seen an Italian style hot sauce, but you know what? Give me the clipboard, sign me up, put me a number one. I'm trying this today. So let's go ahead and check out the ingredients, which I kind of glanced at yesterday. And you know what? Pretty impressive because it's a little different, but we're going to go ahead and list them off. We got the roasted red peppers. We got some water. We got balsamic di Modena IGP. Must be something, must be Italian, huh? But uh, the one thing that I really liked about this was the first ingredient is roasted red peppers. It's pretty cool, you know? It means the most, you know, the, the most of the weight of the ingredients there is coming from the roasted red peppers. So, nice work over there in Italia. Uh, we got, next, we got a little um, Calabrian, Calabrian, Calabrian peppers, hot peppers, and lemon juice, sugar, some cayenne pepper, spices, salt, natural flavorings. Hmm, what's the natural flavorings in there? Um, and then we got dried porcini mushrooms. Dried porcini mushrooms, that I'm excited about. Um, I, mushrooms just give a delicious flavor and somebody, you know, I feel like we all came as, as youth We didn't really like mushrooms, but the older we get, they're pretty damn good And they're good in other ways too, if you know what I mean, jelly bean Anyways, uh, today we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna try it out Yesterday I was out and about, stopped at a little, uh, pub and grub place I got myself a black bean burger with some delicious sweet potato fries So, I got half of that bad boy left So we're gonna go ahead and try it Fidelis Italian hot sauce. You guys know the drill. Let's open this live on camera for all you peeps out there. There we go. Let's twist out this beautiful looking bottle over there. Man, you know what I felt like? I don't really know what I felt like, but I just, the, the bottle is just what does it for me, guys. Oh, that's delicious. That smells not so spicy. You get the, obviously, the roasted red peppers are going to, they're going to come right at there. They're coming right at your nostrils. Whether, you, whether you're ready for them or not. But you can smell the mixture of flavors. And you got a little, right at the end of it, right, at, right when you're about to put it in park, you got the heat. So let's go ahead. We're going we're gonna to pour it on as we do. Let's give a good serving onto that top toasted bun with some ice chill, not ice cold. I don't want to say that. Who wants ice cold pickle? But I want a good, cold, crisp pickle when I bite into my sandwich. So, hope you're all doing well. Hope you're enjoying the day for what it's worth. Maybe for what it's not worth. But anyways, put a smile on your face and make the most of it. And let's go ahead and give this a taste. So we got Fidelis Italian hot sauce. Alright, I'm going to be very honest. I did not get a bite of the hot sauce in that bite. Let's go ahead. We're just gonna pour it on directly, right there. And let's welcome into Flavor Town, because I am the mayor. Hmm. The flavor of this hot sauce is unmatched. It's like an Italian restaurant crammed into a bottle with a little sprinkle of zest in it. But I'm going to be honest, I'm not getting much heat. I'm getting flavor. It's Flavor City, no doubt about that. But let me see if I can just minimize the taste. Maybe the burger is just a little bit too much for me. So let me go down and about and grab myself some bag of chips, some chip roos we got from Trader Joe's. I'm going to do a Trader Joe's haul sooner than later, you guys. I do miss those TJ hauls. We got blue corn tortilla chips. I want to see if I get some heat, because I'm not getting some heat. I might have to just turn the heat on 
if you know what I mean. But let's go ahead and give this a try. What babbles me is that it says extra hot. Mmm. Again, the flavor is beautiful. That lemon juice, you can really see ties it together. You get the little taste of the porcini mushrooms? Porcini mushrooms? I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong. But um, I'm going to tell you guys right now, this is not a very spicy hot sauce. On the heat scale, I'm putting it at about a 2.7? 2.7. There's really not much heat to it. Flavor-wise, it's delicious. I, I, I can't really give a good indicator of what it would be good on. I think like sandwiches, for the most part, I don't think it would do really well with a hot sauce. So Fidelis, extra hot hot sauce, you guys got to do a little bit better. The taste and flavor-wise, pretty good. But if you're looking for some heat to raise that heat index, you're going to have to look somewhere else. I got some recommendations for Spicy Sunday next week, but I had to put an order in. They just were, wasn't going to be ready in time enough. And that's just how it goes. So I'm going to wrap up this video wishing you all the best. Stay good to each other. Stay good to yourselves. Follow your dreams. What else can I tell you? This is DJP. Stay well, stay hydrated, stay happening, and stay groovy. And above all, stay true to yourselves. I'm out of here. You guys enjoy your Sunday. Keep it real.